In this video, we're going to be demoing the Graco uh, Ultimate Quick Shot Sprayer. <clears throat> so, in the last video, I told you this video was coming. So, we're going to demo this. I also pulled this uh, ground plug out, kind of not realizing or not knowing what this was. I read into it a little bit more, and this part here actually fastens on to the bottom here. It screws in there, and then it does plug in to ground the machine. Um, everything that I've seen, I don't believe you really need that. Um, but obviously, who knows? So we're going to try it without it today. Um, so yeah, let's see how it does. All right, I'm going to spray some water out through it. Um, here we have the adjustment. Looks like up is to prime pump. That way is to spray. So we're going to prime the pump first. This is the belt clip design. Kind of pops in there. The gun does also have a safety on it uh, right here. So red is spray. So. Thought it was on prime pump. It wasn't. because it's water, but it's dripping out a lot. There's also an adjustment here on the back of the gun. You can choose what, uh, what number you want to spray from. So all the way down to one, really light, four, and then 10, I'm sure, full blast. So. All right, now we sprayed some water through it. We're gonna do primer next. So I already filled the cup with uh, primer and opened up the vent hole or else it won't, won't go through. So now I'm gonna spray some primer through. I'm gonna prime the pump first, it's on prime. Turn the safety off. I'm gonna try like five. I'm gonna try spraying at a five. So let me prime it first. Now let's paint, spray it. So used to the handheld that it takes a minute for it to get to the gun, the handheld's more immediate. So let's, let's try it. So far it sprays really really nice. I like the idea that the uh, the gun has the technology in it that when you start and stop you can start and stop on the piece. So this is obviously primer, so it's not going to sit down as nice as the paint, but so far with the 210 tip, it's coming out really, really nice. I like the gun so far. So at the moment, I'm having some issue getting to be consistent. Kind of adding splatters into my product.
recapping the Graco Ultimate uh, Quick Shot Sprayer. So far, I like it. Um, there's a couple things I wish was different. I wish the cord was a little bit longer. Um, if you're spraying in one place, you can just leave this on a sawhorse and spray. If you're spraying a larger object, you do have to put it on your belt. Um, that was pretty nice that at least something small I could put on a sawhorse. The battery life did last pretty long. I think I sprayed probably, I did like an hour of spraying today and I did go through probably one and a half batteries. It's not all that bad. Um, so yeah, overall I'd recommend it. Um, I did have a little bit of issue at the beginning. For some reason it was kind of just like spurting paint a little bit. Thought that was a little bit weird, but that worked itself out and I didn't have that issue again. Um, the other weird thing, I did clean it a little bit in between the primer and paint. I noticed that while I was spraying on the pump setting, there was still stuff, material coming out the, the nozzle, which with the ultimate handheld guns, that would not happen. When you just were pumping it for the pump, it would not spray anything out. So overall, it's not bad. I like it. Um, Definitely a lot nicer being like a solo gun that without the paint and everything with it because it's a lot lighter. You can twist it a lot easier. And of course the feature where it doesn't uh, spurt paint when you pull the trigger and let go being an airless sprayer. That is obviously a great feature. When cleaning it, it was a little weird because I was so used to being able to unscrew the cup, rinse it out, dump it, put water in it and stuff. So this you obviously can't undo the cup with paint in it or it's just going to go all over the place. There's a little bit of a learning curve to that part, but the gun really, really did pretty good. I'm happy with it. Um, I did use, for reference on the video, I did use the 210 tip uh, that it came with. I didn't use the other one. It was the 210 that I used with uh, everything I just sprayed. So, yeah, overall, I like it.